Welcome to the Olympic Trials, the light heavyweight finals of 1960. We see Cassius Clay, who in 1960 had won the national AAU light heavyweight championship, taking on Alan Hudson, South American Games light heavyweight champion and all army heavyweight title holder. 18-year-old Cassius Clay is up against one of the toughest opponents he has ever faced. Hudson has been waiting through all opposition by scoring knockout. Hudson punches from all angles and moves into Clay, forcing Clay to back away. Hudson hits Clay with a vicious left hook, and Clay has scored for one of the rare few times in his career. Now it's Clay on the attack. Clay can hurt you with either hand, and has learned a lot with over 200 amateur fights for his credit. Hudson's powerful punches have hurt Clay, but now Clay sends on the right with Hudson backing away. Hudson is down. Hudson wants to continue, but the referee stops the fight and awards the victory to Cassius Clay. But Dane Allen Hudson, out on his feet, wants to continue. Hudson falls to the canvas without a punch being thrown. The referee, exercising good judgment, sees how busy Hudson is. Hudson still wants to continue, but cooler heads prevail, and Cassius Clay wins a big one over Allen Hudson. Clay went on to win the Olympic light heavyweight title in Rome. He turned professional in October 1960. And in 1964, Cassius Clay amazed the boxing world by defeating Sonny Liston for the heavyweight championship of the world. professional victory of the confident young Cassius Clay. 